lot of speed, and they thread the needle really well. We'll see if Tennyson can stop that here and slow that momentum. That is Bednarik. Second time is the charm for the sophomore on the CAA All-Rookie team. Not necessarily play like a freshman. Shelby Stack went all the way from behind and then finds in front for the score. And here's where the Drexel Dragons are very dangerous. They're in transition, they can thread the needle, they keep their heads up, and they're fast. What a move, what a play by Jamie Schneiderith. She, she was the one who picked up the ground ball, ran the field, and scores the three-time captain. Dangerous foul, just something to just slow them down a little bit, get, our, get their defense back into position. Harris walks in and scores her first of the day. Drexel takes a 3-1 lead. Finder getting a win, now back out to Thornton. Perry again, looking for a slice in that zone, back to Thornton and scores. Carrie Thornton, the junior from Long Island, gets on the board, it's three to two. Here she comes the other way, this time from the right side. Normally we see her from the left side, but she's gonna weave her way in, working it into the middle, the low shot scores, Bednarik again. Here she goes, works from the left side and scores, four to three. Perry on the board. Yeah, I couldn't tell if he was given a card there or if he was just talking about the possession clock. What a feed and what a finish with a short clock. Thornton gets the goal, her second of the day. Thornton has two goals today. Stack. Lewak looking inside. What a catch and what a finish. Thornton's got three. That's the third three-second call here in the first 20 minutes on Drexel. And once again, it leads to a free position. It's Marshall. Marshall to the right side, into the back of the net. She goes. The dodge to the cage and the score. Once again, it's Schneiderith. Jamie. Yeah. Yeah, and I haven't seen her get rattled, you know, e even in the, her hardest moments. Here she goes, goes low and scores. She beats Merlo, and just like that, it's six to six. Harris is second of the day. Yeah, she looks like she's getting ready to step and shoot, step and rip. She does just that, spikes the stick. Towson leads seven six. Dragons trying to tie it up here. Bednarik scores. She does just that. Hat trick for Corinne Bednarik. Harris into the middle, Schneiderith scores. Drexel takes the lead back. This is Lucy. Gets an opportunity to add to their lead here late in the half, and they do just that. It's Lucy Schneiderith once again. Towson, or possession here in the half. <laughs> Lewak over the middle, the quick stick is good. Marshall second. Sliwak, yet another assist. For that to be happening, um, it you majority of the time saw someone run the ball in. Well, there she is, Perry. Her first goal of the half, her second of the day, and just like that, it's a new ball game tied up nine to nine. Here's that matchup we've been watching. Aaron Williams on Colleen Grady. Grady looking over the middle, good pass, good finish. You can see those defensive players, they're pointing, they're shifting their sticks. Their sticks are in the in the passing lane. And it doesn't seem to matter there. They've put away a goal. And that ties it up. It's Sliwak. Her first goal today goes in, going along with her three assists, 10 to 10. Things maybe didn't go well, and it, it didn't maybe necessarily matter at the moment, but there's a loss on their schedule. A couple fakes, and then the score, it's Grady. Her body into everything that she does. She treated that like an eight meter play. Instead, it was a 12 meter free position type. And Perry with a hat trick. Here's Marshall, bounces it in. Towson takes a two goal lead. And get into their offense. Here comes Perry, all the way in. The whistle blows, they'll count it. Perry, five goals today. Yeah, and we've said it all along, Tom. We, we do think Towson's a really good team, and uh, maybe they're just, we're late bloomers. Grady goes high, it scores, cuts the lead to two. Game, so you wonder if that feels more natural to them, it's getting them in sync. Jamie Schneider, it scores, she's got a hat trick. Cuts the lead to one. Looking for the tie, and she gets it. Drexel ties it, 14-14. Dietzel with a chance to send her team to the championship. There she goes. She takes the shot and she makes the shot. 
Drexel's heading to the championship.